This is the Nine Dragons yo-yo, and it makes what should be impossible yo-yo tricks possible. Let me explain. See, yo-yos used to be simple. Made out of wood, you couldn't take them apart, basic tricks only. Then the ball bearing came around, which increased spin time and opened up a whole new world of trick possibilities. But as players started pushing the boundaries, they wanted even more spin, which led to the modern unresponsive yo-yo. They're what everyone uses now. More spin time than you could ever need, ultra-wide shapes, and fancy finger spin caps. But how does yo-yo technology get more advanced? This. That's where the Nine Dragons comes into play. Its free spinning outer shell allows you to grab the yo yo in midair without stopping its spin. So, now what kind of tricks are possible? Well, in this video, we're gonna find out with the ultimate Nine Dragons yo yo battle. But before we get to the rules, let's introduce our competitors. First up, Brandon Vu, two time Australian national yo yo champion. Next, Lucas Decker, the newest viral yo yo YouTube sensation. And third, Gentry Stein, that's me, two time world yo yo champion. We'll each get 20 minutes to create three of our own Nine Dragons yo-yo tricks to perform for our judges. A score of 1 to 10 will be given for each trick based on creativity, difficulty, and presentation, and the player with the highest total score wins. Start the timer in 3, 2, 1, go! Timer has just officially started. 20 minutes, these dudes are going down. The timer has started. Think! Think! What if I like... So what do I do with this yo-yo? You can do that. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Around. Boom. I'm like Iron Man. Nope. Brandon, you know what you should do? Yeah. You should Google. There's this really good video on YouTube. You can steal his best tricks and you can beat both of these punks. Oh, whoa, what is this? Yo, these are sick. Uh, Guys, you have to promise me not to tell Gentry, okay? Shh. Does that even look cool? We are going to try to do multiple. Oh. Oh, yes. Whoa. That's cool. 10 minutes, Lucas. Got it. Do you need me to help you cheat? I'm, I'm actually pretty good right now. You can't let Gentry win. I'm, I'm pretty good. Oh. Oh. That's fire. That's so fire. You could pull these apart. And now you have two yo yeah. Something just off the foot. <laughs> How did I just think of this now? Then you can have one yo-yo here, and then you can have one yo-yo here. And that is time! Oh time, god. Time, I think I went into this a little bit uh, overconfident. I'm in a bit of deep doo-doo. I've only got two tricks, so I'm gonna have to make one up on the fly. Let's do this! So, uh, how you guys feeling about your tricks? You going down this time, Gentry. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Rock, paper, scissors to see who goes first. Alright. Ready? One, Wait. two, three. Let's go. I'm gonna go first, Brandon second, Gentry third. Round one. Fight. This is the Hercules. Oh, oh. Big dog. Oh. 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 That was a really good trick. Yeah. Originality, pretty high there. Everybody likes to see a good DNA and an AND. And that last bit with the bicep took it to the next level. 8.0. Beautiful form, love the body movement. I'll give an 8.5. All right, I'll take it, I'll take it. Lucas kicks it off with a 16.5. Representing Australia, Brandon Boo! Okay, so, you know, I'm not as buff as Lucas is right now. This trick is called the Penitent Man. First attempt, let's go. Okay. <laughs> Oh, okay. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I like the name. I like the theme. He executed it. There's room to go up from here though. 7.5. Okay. All right. All right. The execution was great. I'll give an 8.0. Oh, all right. Sick. We got this. Brandon comes in just a point behind Lucas. All right, baby. This one's called roulette. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, okay. Hey. Oh! Hey. Dang. Let's go. 
Let's go! He really took advantage of the catch and pass style that only the Nine Dragons can provide. And that flip at the end, which gave it the roulette name, that was nasty. That is a banger of a trick. If I know anything, it's to not challenge Gentry to competition. I'm giving you one point for every dragon for that trick. That's a Woo! That was world champion material. That's a 9.5 for Woo! me. Let's go! Money. In the bag. Okay. I take round one, two points above Lucas at 18.5. Now for round two. I'm a little irritated that I got bumped down a second. Taking over the world champion is not going to be easy, but I got something up my sleeve. Quick interruption. If you'd like to try some of these tricks you've seen so far or create some of your own tricks with the Nine Dragons, you can get one on my website, gentrysign.com. The link's in the description. Back to the video. This trick is called tension. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Oh, oh. 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 Yeah. 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 That was an amazing trick. I love the name. I love the way that it built up, the structure of the trick. It started getting harder and harder and harder. And then there were the dangerous elements in the catches. The loop had to stay open through the whole thing. The payoff at the end, that was amazing. I give it a 9.5. Hey. Fantastic trick. I love the build up and arguably the hardest trick we've seen here today. I'm gonna give it a nine. Hey. All right, I'm taking it, I'm taking it. Lucas steps it up in round two with an 18.5. Low key, I'm kind of sick of being the last player, so we're gonna bump our score up. So I'm gonna try and improvise something, so this trick is gonna be called Impromptu. All right. <laughs> okay. expectations <laughs> and it finished really strong. I put my heart, my soul into that. I rolled around on the ground. I went high, I went low, I jumped up, I went to the ground. I'm expecting a pretty high score from this. 4.0. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> four? Oh. It was a really nice behind the back DNA, but I could have done that without seeing your midriff. <laughs> it started low for me, but he stuck to landing. I'll give it a seven. Yeah! Okay, okay. Yeah! All right, you know what? Can't stop, won't stop. We're still in this game. 11 points for Brandon. Not his best. I call this one the Ronaldo. Ooh. I'm expecting some foot play. Okay. Oh! Let's go, Gentry. Oh! Oh, oh, oh! oh. Hey. oh. Hey. It's Ronaldinho! Yo, that trick, <laughs> that trick was progressive yo-yoing right there. We've never, ever seen him use his feet like that. I'm gonna give him another nine. Ooh! I love the trick, brand new, beautiful. I'll give him 8.5. Okay, okay. Who okay. won't stop me, huh? It's a close game after round two, but let's see how this battle ends in the final round. The dragon trap. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. 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 It up. Yeah. Oh. Ooh. Oh, hey. oh. Oh. That was a great trick to demonstrate one of the abilities of the non-dragon in catching, but it only really demonstrated that one single ability. There were opportunities to spice it up. Really clean trick, great execution, 7.0. Okay, just want a little more bells and whistles, a little more fireworks. I'll also give it a 7.0. Okay. Lucas ends his final round with a 49. Let's see what Brandon's got. We have spent this entire competition at the back of the pack. I hope using all of my strength, all of my difficulty, and all of my yo-yos, it's gonna bump me up. So up until this point, people have only been using one dragon, so I'm gonna add a second one to the mix. This trick's called Double Dragon. So the first part of this is the pull start. It's pretty difficult, but not for me. Ooh. All right. Okay. Oh. oh. Yeah. Yeah. All right. No, but there's more, guys. Oh. 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 What? What? <laughs> what was that? Brandon came in this round from down under. Every element of the trick better than the last. I'm gonna give him a one. Zero for a ten. Yeah! Woo! Yeah! Still in last place, but yeah! That was a really generous score. I'm going to say that that was probably the most impressive trick of the day. So uh -huh. I'm going to give him a score of 8.5.
Come on, man! That was like most Boy, impressive trick of the day. Boy, Brandon. I'm gonna give you an 8.5 for each yo-yo. Oh! oh it's currently what? in the lead. Hey, all right, that's it. Gentry, you're up. Brandon takes 27 out of 20 points after a questionable curveball in the rules, putting him into first place. That's right. was cool, yeah, but it's time to take the dub. <laughs> The moment of truth. We're going to give the scores for Gentry's final trick. He needs an 18 to win. Augie, what have you got? Great effort. One of my favorites from Gentry Day. He was all over the place. Beautiful catch. I'm giving it a 9. I'll cool. take it, baby. You know, that was a very impressive trick. There's one thing holding it back from me. Didn't really show the diversity in a trick that I wanted to see like that. And I give it an 8.5. And if my math is correct, Augie, it is a tie. Oh, oh yeah. So we're technically, no. I came back, we're at, we're at the same level. No. I'm a world champion. I'm technically no. on we, the world champion level. We all know level. who took the win. That's All a wrap. Right.